audio. So I have a EEC Ford here that I recently repaired. Um, originally it just needed the capacitors done and a few traces uh, fixed that had you know deteriorated away from the old capacitors leaking. But a customer got it back and they say it's still making their fuel pump run uh, continuously to uh, you know the saying the fuel pump doesn't cut off like it's supposed to and they want me to double check it to make sure that the driver is not bad for that now whenever I do these that is a function that I test for before I send them back so it would have been good before I sent it back or you know I would have fixed that before sending it back um, and I advised the customer that it's going to be external, but they still want me to double check it. So we're going to do that real quick today. All right, so looking at this diagram here, we're going to hook everything up just like what it's shown here. Uh, currently, we have the power and the grounds coming in. And we have our fuel pump control, which is a ground signal that goes to a fuel pump relay. Um, I don't have this number 8 hooked up. Let me go ahead and hook that up. Then we will hook in our relay and everything into our board. All right, so I've got everything connected here just like it would be connected uh, in the truck. We have our fuel pump relay here. It gets its 12 volt uh, coil power from the fuse box. It also gets the 12 volt that's getting switched to the fuel pump from the fuse box. And then it gets the ground control for the relay from the PCM. Okay, and that's for the pin 22. On the fuel pump output, I have a lamp here, which is going to act as our fuel pump. When that lamp is illuminated, that means our fuel pump would be on. When the lamp cuts off, obviously our fuel pump would cut off. And I also have this, um, I guess it's some kind of sense for the fuel pump to make sure that the it's getting power. This goes to the pin 8 on the PCM. So like if we go back and look at the diagram here. It's, it's this one right here, this 8. Um, so I have that hooked in too. I don't think that really matters, but uh, just just for fun, I have that hooked in as well. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and hit the ignition switch. What we should see is this fuel pump lamp come on briefly and then cut back off. That would be normal operation. Uh, customer's complaint is that this cuts on and does not cut off. So let's see what's going to happen here. There we go. So the fuel pump come on, it primed, and then it cut off. Okay, so I'm going to try it again. You see this means ignition is off, and I'm going to ignition on. There we go. We see it come on, and we cut off. So yeah, it looks like the fuel pump relay control is working properly. I do not see any issues there with it. Um, if uh, any of you guys out there work on these trucks, I believe this is a 93. It's either a Bronco or maybe like a, you know F-Series. I'm not too sure. But if any of you guys out there work on these trucks and you know what might be causing the fuel pump to constantly run, uh, you know, leave me a comment. I can help my customer. Um, or if there's something else here in the logic, maybe a different type of sensor or something that would cause the fuel pump to stay on, definitely let me know that as well.